Meet Ali. Ali is actually 35 years old, and Ali lives in Karachi, Pakistan. He works as a project manager, and he earns about $10,000 per year. Like 97% of the Pakistani population, Ali is also a Muslim. And like most Muslims, he has a dream of fulfilling his family's lifelong dream of performing the Muslim pilgrimage known as Umrah. Umrah is a spiritual journey to the holiest places for Muslim, the Holy Kaaba in Mecca, Saudi Arabia. So to plan his journey, he starts by planning it himself. He goes online and looks on Airbnb, Booking.com, Kareem, and taxis to make a general budget for himself. However, the prices he finds online are all over the place. The first platform quotes him a prominent hotel for $330 per night, while another two platforms offer the exact same hotel for $297 and $200 respectively. Regardless, existing travel platforms will cost him at least $2,600 per person for a trip of 21 days. So Ali is overwhelmed by the cost and the variability of the pricing. So he goes to his community for referrals for travel agents. However, they tell him some horror stories. One of his friends had a travel agent that had run away with all of his money. Another told him how he booked a five-star hotel only to be told a week before his trip that the hotel room was no longer available. And when he arrived, he actually got a three-star hotel instead but still had to pay the same price. Another friend warns him that the travel agents might tell him his visa was rejected just so they can charge him a second time for the reapplication. We're Umrah companions, and we are the trusted travel companions for pilgrims. We take care of the entire planning, travel, and post-travel process, including su suggesting the flights, hotels and transfer bookings, local guidance, and e-visa issuance. Let me show you guys how it works. So the religious leader at Ali's local mosque, known as an imam, refers Ali to Umrah Companions. So Ali goes on to Umrah Companions web slash app, and he signs up in one easy step. Well, upon signing up, Ali is able to go ahead and, and log into the website. And once he logs in, he's immediately able to, to access the website uh, through just a, a simple verification on his email. Then he goes ahead and selects whether he needs a land package or a flight package. And then he browses through the available packages and selects the package that makes most sense for him. Upon reviewing the itinerary, he selects the date that he's looking to travel on. And then he can move forward and input the traveler's information to get his e-visa directly from the website. Once he uh, puts in the traveler's information, then he can move forward to the payment processing. So for each transaction, Umrah Companions gets a 20% in commission fees per passenger, depending on the service. And Umrah Companions creates for Ali an end-to-end -end package for $2,150, a cost saving of 20% against his initial budget. Because over 50% of Ali's costs will be his flight, Umrah Companions assures him things are take, being taken care of immediately by issuing his flight ticket and upon receipt of his payment, uh, he's able to now take this uh, flight confirmation number and check it on the airline website. Now, before Ali departs, this is where the companionship begins. Uh, he will be added actually to a private WhatsApp group managed by Umrah Companions. And this WhatsApp group actually includes Umrah Companions on the ground team in Saudi Arabia, uh, offering him a 24-7 support during his journey. So this WhatsApp group is kind of like his personal concierge service team. And the day before Ali arrives, the Omar Companions team in Saudi Arabia goes to the hotel to ensure everything is in order. When Ali arrives in Saudi Arabia, the Omar Companions team is ready to welcome him either at the airport or at his hotel. So now Ali can visit Saudi Arabia to smoothly fulfill his lifelong dream and religious commitments of the Umrah pilgrimage. So let's talk about the market size. Today, the TAM for Hajj and Umrah pilgrimage is 80 billion US dollars uh, just for this year alone. And today, 80% of this is driven by transactions through traditional travel agents who support 20 million travelers to perform the Muslim pilgrimage. And under Vision 2030, the Saudi government 
expects tourism into Saudi Arabia to increase 30% year over year to reach 250 billion US dollars by the year 2030. So post COVID, the Ministry of Tourism has introduced regulatory changes to attract more B2C customers and targeting at least 100 million people to travel to Saudi Arabia by the year 2030. So I'd like to introduce you guys to my team. These are the people who made this vision a reality. And starting from our CEO and co-founder, Salman Arayn, he was previously the director of IT and risk management for Intercontinental Hotels Group. And then later he joined the Transcontinental Media Group as the director of shared services. Through his role, he was actually able to uplift the company's operations to drive revenue from $1.8 billion to $2.2 billion. My name is Saad Ali, and I'm the CMO and co-founder of Umrah Companions. And when I was 15 years old, I ran operations full-time in a hotel in Mecca. And as the hotel manager, I needed to ensure our occupancy stayed high and our average daily rate was maintained. Later on, I was an early employee at Joey Co., a last mile logistics company in Toronto. And I was in charge of operations, making sure that all of our packages from corporations like Walmart and Amazon were delivered to their customers on time every week. Our revenues actually grew from $4 million to $30 million within a year. So we operate as an online to offline operation with both a digital presence and an on-ground support, offering an end-to-end turnkey solution to our customers. We also have very strategic distribution in our key markets. And this is essentially through multilateral partnerships that we have established in an effort to drop our customer acquisition costs. For an instance, Pakistani banking super app, Zindagi, has given Umrah Companions exclusive promotions across their 5 million users and their 622 physical locations across Pakistan. We're also the trade partners, uh, appointed the trade partners for the Saudi Tourism Authority to promote Saudi Arabia as the next tourist destination of the world. And every month, we actually have over 40,000 people that log into our website and browse our packages. In addition to this, we actually have 18,500 travel agents registered with us around the world. And last year, in 2022, we generated $14 million in GMV. And on that, we made about 17% in commissions. And this year, we're actually on track to do $1.3 million US dollars in net profit. 